Hi, Michelle from Pure Electric. In this video, we're going to be looking at how to maximize the range of your electric scooter. If you've just got your hands on an e-scooter, or if you're a seasoned rider, knowing how to get the most range out of your scooter is always important. Fortunately, there are some easy tricks and tips to help you go as far as possible. But before we get into those, don't forget to like, subscribe, and click the little bell icon so you get notified every time we upload a new video. Tip number one, keep your tire pressure topped up, but not by too much. So what do we recommend? As you'd expect, we recommend sticking within the recommended pressures, which you'll find written on the side of the tire. If you require a pump, we have a whole range available at Pure Electric, and you'll find the links to those in the video description below. Tip number two, carry less weight. Now you've optimized your tire pressure, it's time to look at how much extra weight you're carrying on your e-scooter. Adding a few extra kilos with a heavy bag, boots, or just pockets full of loose change and whatever else you're carrying will all make a small dent in your e-scooter's range. Now, obviously, we're not suggesting you ride naked or ride without the essentials, but putting some effort into optimizing what you're carrying could make a real difference to your total range. I found going through my backpack and removing all the junk that wasn't essential was an easy start. And if you can think of any other creative ways of shedding some weight from your kit, we'd love to hear about them in the comments. Tip number three. When appropriate, go easy on the brakes and accelerations. Just like if you're trying to get the best miles per gallon from your car, you want to go easy on the accelerations and the brakes to get the best range from your e-scooter. This doesn't mean you shouldn't pull hard on them in an emergency, but letting off the brakes early and coasting to a stop instead of going full speed then slamming on the brakes will save you some all important battery power. Same goes for accelerations. Instead of pressing down on the throttle straight away, try to ease yourself up to top speed nice and slowly. Being able to anticipate what's coming ahead so you can ease off the throttle early and accelerating in a controlled manner are both excellent ideas when it comes to maximizing your range. Number four, keep your e-scooter clean. Keeping your e-scooter clean and in top working condition will help maximize its range. A prime example would be something like a twig or a bit of mud getting stuck under your mud guard. You may not notice it's there, but it could be causing drag, which makes your motor work harder. And that, my friends, will reduce your range, which if you haven't gathered by now, is what we don't want. Finally, keep an eye on your brakes, particularly if you have disc brakes. If the pads start to rub on the disc, you'll again have some unwanted drag costing you range. Tip number five, if you can, avoid those hills. Every time you hit a hill on your e-scooter, the motor has to work harder, and this will reduce your range quicker than mainly sticking to flat roads. If you live somewhere really hilly, then this one may be tricky. But for those who live in flatter areas, trying to avoid the hills for finding alternative routes is a good way to get the best range from your e-scooter. Our final tip, think about your clothing. Now, in an effort to make you as aerodynamic as possible, we're not suggesting you go out and buy Tour de France style Lycra, but wearing clothing that doesn't flap around in the wind will help maximize the range of your e-scooter. The benefits may be pretty small. However, remembering to zip up your jacket so it's not flapping in the wind will still make a difference. And if you're looking to eke out every last mile or kilometer from your battery, then all the small differences add up. So, now that you know how to get the maximum range from your e-scooter, you may want to learn how to get your battery to last as long as possible. And there should be a box appearing to that very video around now. And finally, don't forget to like, 
subscribe and click that bell icon so you get notified when we upload a new video. Thanks for watching, goodbye.